Well, I'm not sure if that $3 million price reduction got your attention, but 3239 Noella Drive and Diamond Head just reduced by $3 million earlier this month. This is the second $3 million price reduction, the last of which took place in June uh, since it's been on the market. The original asking price was $25 million, and they hit the market originally in November of 2023. Now, you might ask yourself, is this a good buy now at $19 million, or is it not a good buy? Well, I'm going to break it down, the pros and cons of the current price and what you're getting for this trophy property at Diamond Head. First off, I'm going to talk about why this is not a good buy at the current price. So this home has over 16,000 square feet of living area. Not many people want to maintain a property that big, even if they can afford it. Next, there haven't been too many non-oceanfront homes on Oahu that have sold over $10 million. In the past 10 years, there's only been seven sales. And the highest sale of those was for a new construction home in Lanikai for $14 million. The highest, most recent uh, sale north of 10 million was for 3222 Diamond Head Road, right around the corner from here, that sold for $12 million earlier this year. Now, those are the reasons why I do not think this is a good buy. Now, on the flip side, some of the pros may outweigh the cons. So now let me break down to you why this is a good buy. The first reason of which uh, that sale on Diamond Head Road went for $2,549 a square foot on a lot that was less than half the size. The current asking price in this Noella home of 19 million puts it at only $1,133 a square foot. The second reason, for someone truly looking for a trophy property on Oahu, this checks a lot of the boxes. The highest sale we had on Oahu last year was $27.5 million. However, that was for a penthouse condo at Park Lane. I think if you were to take a poll of if someone wanted to own a 16,000 square foot home on an acre on the slopes of Diamond Head or a condo in Ala Moana, I think most would opt for the Diamond Head home. The next reason is this is also a bargain when comparing to other luxury markets across the U.S., such as Aspen, Colorado, Malibu, California, Palm Beach or Miami in Florida or Manhattan and in New York. Uh, this is really a great value, especially when you think about what you're getting a price per square foot, like we talked about earlier. Okay, now for a little bit of history on 3239 Noella. Going back to 1987, local developer Jack Meyer bought the McCorriston estate for $1,350,000 and built a new home that was over 10,000 square feet and featured a tennis court. He sold it in the year 2000 for $9 million, which at the time was you know a high price tag on Oahu back in the year 2000. So the next owner carried it uh, then for 19 years before selling at a loss actually in 2009 for $8,750,000. I thought the current owner got a great buy back then just after the financial crisis. However, they went on to demolishing the tennis court and adding an additional home in its place, which brought the current living area up to 16,768 square feet. Now to recap this, there aren't as many buyers floating around out there that have the means to pay close to $20 million for a home here on Oahu. And the truth is that these homes can take a while to sell. Whether that buyer shows up next year or next month, only time will tell. If you're looking for some help navigating the luxury home market here on Oahu or thinking about buying or selling, feel free to reach out and give me a call at 808-371-3509. Mahalo.